Hello children, are you ready for another phonics? Pencil and paper ready for later? Then let us begin. We are going to start with some listening. And today it's going to be a memory game and it's going to be what I, what did I say? So I'm going to say three words and I'm going to say them twice and then I want you to repeat them, okay? In the same order. So listen carefully. Here we go. Orange kettle mouse. I'll say it again. Orange kettle mouse. You say it. Think you remember the three of them? Let's have a look. Orange kettle mouse. Did you get it? Well done. Okay. This time it's going to be four words. So listen carefully. Toothbrush biscuit zebra swim. Toothbrush biscuit zebra swim. Can you say it? You think you've got all four? Let's say them again. Are you ready? Toothbrush biscuit zebra swim. Did you get them? Fantastic. Okay. This time there are going to be five words. So listening carefully. Milk, balloon, house, cat, pencil. Milk, balloon, house, cat, pencil. Can you say them? I think you got all five. Let's say them together. Are you ready? Milk, balloon, house, cat, pencil. Did you get all five? in the right order. Fantastic. Okay, you need your pencils now because you are going to write some graphemes for me and some words. So the first grapheme I'd like you to write is R. R. Could you write me the grapheme for R? And pop the sound button underneath. Have you done it? Which sound button do you need? A sausage because it's a digraph, isn't it? Let's see if you got it right. R, A and R gives us the R grapheme, doesn't it? And we, it's a digraph because it's two letters making one sound. Using R, could you write me the word start? Start. So sound talk start to your paper. Remember, pop your sound buttons underneath to check it. I think there's four phonemes in that word, so you should have how many sound buttons? Four, that's right. Are you ready? Let's have a look. Sound talk it with me. St, art, start. Well done. Okay, the next grapheme I'd like you to write is oi. Oi. Can you remember how to write it? Have you done it? Let's have a look. Oi. O and I gives us the oi grapheme, doesn't it? Brilliant. Using oi, could you write me the word spoil? Spoil. So sound talk spoil to your paper. Remember, sound button it to check it. Do you think you've done it? Let's have a look. Sound talk it with me. Sp, oi, oh, spoil. Did you get it? Fantastic. Okay, the next graphic I'd like you to write me is I. I. Can you remember how we write the graphene for I? Think you've done it? Let's have a look. I-G-H gives us the I graphene, doesn't it? And which sound button would go under here? A sausage. Because this is a trigraph, isn't it? We've got three letters making one sound, I. Using I, could you write me the word bright? The sun is very bright today. Bright, so sound talk bright. Listen to all of the sounds when you say it. Bright. Four phonemes, 
So you should have four sound buttons to check it. Remember sound talking it to your paper? Right. I think you've done it. Shall we have a look? Did you check it? Okay. Sound talk it with me. B -r -i -t. Right. Did you get that one? Fantastic. Okay, the last grapheme I need you to write is ng. Ng. How do we write the grapheme for ng? Have you written it? Let's check. Mm. N and G makes our mm grapheme, doesn't it? Using this grapheme, could you write me the word bring? Bring. Could you bring me some pencils, please? Bring. So sound talk it to your paper. And then sound button it to check it. Have you done it? Have you checked it? Let's have a look. Sound talking with me. B -r -i -n. Bring. Well done. Okay, pop your pencils down and stand up because you are going to say the sounds that you see. Remember, say them before I do and don't forget to show me those actions. Here we go. Down, up, down, up. I. Down the body and dot for the head. Oi. Ah. Down and under, up to the top and draw the puddle. K. Curl around the caterpillar. Ch. E. Lift off the top and scoop out the egg. A. Down the arm and leg and repeat the other side. Down the pirate's plait and around his face. Mm. Down Nobby and over his net. Mm. T. Down the tower, across the tower. B. Down the laces to the heel and around the toe. Y. Down a horn, up a horn and under his head. D. Around the dinosaur's bottom, up his tall neck and down to his toes. Air. G. Around the girl's face, down her hair and give her a curl. E. A. Around the apple and down the leaf. O. All around the orange. Ow. Mm. Down a wing, up a wing. S. Slither down the snake. U, uh, or it can be oo. Did you get it? Brilliant. Down the kangaroo's body, tail and leg. Zzz. Zig, zag, zig. Qua. Round her head, up past her earring, down her hair and flick. Uh. Zzz. Down his body, curl and dot. Ear. Mmm. Down Maisy, mountain, mountain. Oh. Sh. Oh. Ah. Down his head, to his hooves and over his back. Or it can be mm. Did you say them both? Did you stick your tongues out? Brilliant. Down the stem and draw the leaves. Zzz. Down the robot's back and curl over his arm. 
Oh. Oh. Down the long leg. I. Uh. Oh. And we are going to go back to uh. Well done. I took it a bit far, didn't I? Okay, sit down because you are going to sound and blend some words. Now remember, these words are all of a mixture of the graphemes that you've learned, okay? So look carefully and remember when I press the sound buttons, you're going to sound talk it and what are you going to do at the end of the word? You are going to blend it all together. So are you ready? Here we go. Have a look first. Look for those digraphs and trigraphs and then we'll sound talk. Think you got it? Let's do it together. Sp each speech. I made a speech. Okay, what about this one? Have a look. Ready to sound talk? I'll join in. B -r -ow -n. Brown. Well done. Have a look. Ready? I'll join in. St, art, start. Well done. Have a look. Are you ready? I'll do it with you. K, r, a, n, ch, crunch. Did you get that one? Fantastic. Okay, have a look at this one. Are you ready? Think you've got it? Let's do it together. St, r, eat, street. If you're finding it difficult to remember some of these blends at the beginning, you could sound talk st, r, st, r, eat, st, r, eat, street. So you can break it up to help you, okay? Have a look at this one. Ready? I'll join in. B -a -n -k. Bank. I went to the bank to get some money. Have a look at this one. You ready? I'll join in. G -a -up. Gulp. I took a gulp of water. Well done. Okay, we are going to do some writing. Now today what I thought we'd do, we are going to write a few sentences, okay? Kind of a mini story. So what does a sentence have to have at the beginning? A capital letter. And in between each of our words, what does it have to have? A finger space. And what goes at the end of a sentence? A full stop. So are you ready to hear the first sentence in our little story? Okay, listening carefully. This frog is strong. This frog is strong. Can you say it? Brilliant. Let's write our sentence. This frog is strong. This, one of our high frequency words, but if you need to sound talk it, you can. This. Th is. This frog. Leave a space. Remember, sound talk those words you're unsure of. This frog is strong. Is strong. I'm going to sound talk strong. Oh, Mrs. Goodwin hasn't left much room there, have I? This frog is strong. Brilliant. Full stop. That's the end of my sentence. This frog is strong. Okay, you ready for the next bit? Here we go. His skin, I'll say it again. His green skin has bumps. His green skin has bumps. Can you say it? Brilliant, let's write it. Remembering we've just had a full stop, so what do we need now? A capital letter. His green skin has bumps. Remember, keep saying that over to yourself while you're writing it. His. Another one of our high frequency words. His. Gr 
g r e n his green skin k i n his green skin has bumps a has bumps b a bumps Check it first. His green skin has bumps. Full stop. Fantastic. Okay. That's brilliant. Now we need to read both sentences together. Are you ready? Do they start, does each of your sentences rather, or do each of your sentences start with a capital letter? My one does here. Then I've got a full stop, and then I've got a capital letter and another full stop. Brilliant. Now read it, okay, and check what you've written. This frog is strong. His green skin has bumps. Fantastic. You could even write another sentence if you wanted to, like, I don't know, he likes to swim in the pond, maybe. Okay, you can write whichever, whichever sentence you like. Fantastic. Okay, pop your pencils down and we shall move on. I have some pictures here, as you saw earlier. I'm going to put a word up, and I need you to read that word and match it to the picture. So, what does this word say? What does it say? So, which picture does it belong with? Let's see if you're right. Sound talking with me? Sk, a, n, k, skunk. Yes, it's a picture of a skunk, isn't it? Okay, what about the next one? Can you read this word? Sound talking, remember first. What do you think it says? So which picture does it go with? Let's see if you're right. Sound talking with me. St, r, str, i, n. String. Did you get it? Well done. Okay, let's look at the next one. Mm. Now you might need to break this word up to help you. I must sound talk it. What do you think it says? Do you know what it is? Which picture it would go with? Shall we see if you're right? Let's have a look. Did you get it? Let's sound talk it together. D r i f t drift w u d wood drift wood driftwood. Did you get it? The picture of the driftwood. Fantastic! Well done. Okay, let's look at our high frequency and tricky words. Now remember, you need to read them before I do. So are you ready? Here goes. With her. Are now then went said like have from little do there when one children. Did you remember most of those? Well done, fantastic. Children, you have worked really, really hard. It's going to be my last video for a little while, but don't forget, you can keep watching all of the other videos over and over again and keep practicing, okay? And don't forget, ask mummy and daddy to subscribe, and then if I do anything new, it will come up automatically. Listen, children, be the best that you can be and I will see you very soon for some more phonics. Bye bye.